what up people what up y'all i'm doing a whole life in my car camp never this is not even a live it's just a video what y'all doing happy friday what's everybody doing tonight i'm in traffic and we may as well talk okay what y'all been up to y'all been watching good shows getting christmas presents what have y'all been up to are you stressed out about christmas because you gotta get the gifts and put up the decorations and then people have lost jobs. So a lot of people are stressed about Christmas. It's just not a good time for everybody. And it is really stressful. Um, I wanted to come to you guys next week. I want to do my videos, the 12 days of Christmas, because if you guys don't know, I'm about to tell you that my love language is presents. Okay, gifts, I love, okay, there we go. I love gifts, you guys, that's like my love language. And G, his is, I think his is like words of affirmation. But I'm definitely a gift girl. I love stuff. I don't know if it's because I grew up and I didn't have a lot of stuff. Or I'm just a girl and I just like stuff. Um, I'm going right now to a girls' night out with my girls, Farah and Sierra. We're just going to go eat and have some drinks and catch up. Um, and just talk. You know, just do the girl thing. That's what tonight's all about. It's Friday night. Um, so that should be fun. But... <clears throat> Tell me if you guys are interested. I want to do the 12 days of Christmas because it's a requirement if you're going to be with me that, oh, not this truck. Oh, I'm sorry, y'all. Uh -huh. It's a requirement if you're going to be with me that you have to do the 12 days of Christmas. If I ever get married, it's going to be my marriage contract. So what it is, is every day, December 12th, starting December 12th, we get each other a gift. The gift has to be under $20 and you do it leading up to Christmas. So it starts December 12th. So I'm going to come on here. And I plan on showing you every day what I got him and what he got me. And I think that could be a cute little segment. Now, if you guys are not interested in that, please let me know. Because you guys were like, we don't want to see this bull. Y'all going to watch it, okay? Support it, watch it, love it, like it. And then maybe you'll get some cute ideas of what you want to get your person or your parents or your kids or whoever. Um, all the gifts are typically under $20. I try to keep my stuff under $20. So it's not like big, major gifts, but it's just uh, random stuff that when you know your person, you kind of know what they like. So the gifts are like just random stuff. I can't wait to show you guys. So let me know if that's a segment. It's not even called a segment. I don't know what the hell it's called. But let me know if that is something that you guys will be interested in. I know you guys love the trying hauls. And girl, I cleaned out my closet because I've been doing all these trying hauls. Oh my god and my freaking closet's ball headed i don't have any more clothes so y'all i got to go and i gotta uh do some trying hauls for y'all because I, I don't have any clothes okay so gotta get to shopping um it's just stuff takes forever because it's christmas everything is taken for a shower on this light okay i ain't gonna do it because i'm already illegally on the phone mm -hmm. i'm late these happen 600 late. feet turn right not her the uh, not the lady square. okay excuse her um these girls I go with, they're always late. Sierra and Farah. It's mainly Sierra. Sorry, Sierra. Hey, girl. Hey, girl. Hey. But I had to put you on blast. She always be late. I kept it cute. And I kept it casual, basic. You know, I have on a bodysuit and just a flannel because it's freezing. My daddy's calling me, y'all. Oh, he wants me to look at TikTok for something. I don't know. Um, but anyways, I hope you guys are enjoying uh, my content and I'm coming to you with more stuff. Let me know if you're interested in the There's 12 days of Christmas. There's a 17 minute slowdown on California 60 East in four miles. You are still on the best route. It don't sound like the best route to me, bitch. <laughs> she, she got life. Oh man, she got life up, okay? Excuse me, how's that the 17 minute slowdown? Girl, I'm supposed to be there by 4.30, okay? You guys, I'm one of those people, when I come somewhere, I come on time, I get there early. But oh, I stress out so bad when I'm late. I'm like, oh my God, it gives me anxiety. And it's like, why? You're not working, you're not getting paid. But then we have reservations and I hate not being late for my reservations. And I do open table and you don't get your point. So I'm that girl, I'm trying to be on time, but I already know these have us on way They're not gonna be here on time. They can live across the street from the restaurant and still be late. Uh, and tonight, what are we doing? We doing Mexican tonight, honey. We doing Mexican food. Let me take off my glasses so y'all can see my eyes. Yeah. Um, oh, I look tired, girl. It's been a rough couple of nights. Do you guys like the hair? I don't do colored hair. But um, I tried something different because I've been doing the same. I love jet black hair. I just think it's so pretty on anybody. Um, <clears throat> but I tried something different. So I got to get Turn used right to it the state 60 East for the ramp. fall. All right, guys, we're getting on the freeway. And you know they said we got a 17-minute delay, honey. Let's see what it is. So, honey, okay, this is my first time vlogging in the car. In mile, merge onto California 60 right. East. Y'all know I don't know where I'm going. It looks like I'm going to be sitting here based off of what old girl just said. She talking about there's a 17-minute slowdown. Not me sitting in this traffic for 17 minutes. Ugh, this was all my ideas, so I'm super irritated with myself. Oh, I'm 
I'm so annoyed with myself and it's hot so I'm, I'm gonna take my little flannel off because you know gas costs a thousand dollars I ain't trying to turn this air on honey it's 50 degrees outside I just need to take off this jacket okay back to what I was saying um today I got the the um what's it called the email saying I was monetizing on California I, 60 East for eight miles she got one more time to interrupt me but anyways I was so freaking happy I had tears in my eyes it took me um a really long time to like to get to this point so I just I'm so grateful to you guys never expected it to happen this fast and I just want to say thank you so much I appreciate you guys I just can't say that enough it means everything to me I just have to start being more uh, what's it called what's it called not predictable what's the word I'm looking for you guys uh, when you do it every day consistent took me a minute I got to start being more consistent because you know I just be coming on here when I feel like it, honey. But now that you guys are actually watching, it makes me want to come on here all the time. Look at that, I got skills. I took it off while I was driving, honey, yes. But it makes me want to come on here all the time just for my people. Let me put my glasses on, y'all, because the sun is bright, okay? Y'all see the sun? I'm not trying to be disrespectful, but the sun is bright. Ain't these cute, these is Prada's, honey. I got these as a gift last year. Oh, I felt so much better. Y'all know I'm pre-menopausal, honey. Let me get out the slow lane. Let me get out the slow lane. Y'all see how I'm like, I could drive and talk, you know, us girls. We know how to multitask. I'm super easily distracted, but um, I could drive and talk, and I'm in my cute, my dream, it's not really my dream car, but um, after, let me tell you guys a little bit about myself too. So I am a retired officer. I worked at a prison. Believe it or not, I was an officer for 22 years, and just recently, I medically retired. So that's kind of what brought me to YouTube. I was like, let me, you know, because I don't know what I want to do yet, because I still feel like I'm really young. Um, but there are some things I can do, so I do. That's when I started to do YouTube. Um, but I worked at the prison for 22 years, so as a retirement president, I bought myself my favorite car, which is uh, a Ford Bronco. I think it's so sexy. It's very loud, and I really can't hear with the roof. It's just a very sexy car, so that was my gift to myself. Um, I was gonna have a retirement party, but eh, I kind of changed my mind. I don't think I just, you know, I got myself the car and that was my gift. And so I'm still trying to find things that I like and things that I want to do. So I do have time and I do have like little random odds and end jobs. Like I do different things. Like I don't just sit around and not do anything all day. I do all kind of random stuff. But YouTube, I want to be my priority. I just thought it'd be so fun because I've always wanted to be like a talk show host or, you know, I love to talk. Honey. I could sit here and talk to you all day. Matter of fact, I talk to myself all the time. I may as well get paid to do it, okay? And talk to somebody else because y'all gonna hear what I gotta say. But um, for those of you who don't know anything about me, that is like a little backstory of who I am. And the prison is in California and it was a women's prison. And I absolutely loved my job. It was tough and you know, it's a very dark, depressing uh, place. But I will say that I do miss the inmates, believe it or not, because they were so funny. And there are so many crazy stories that I could tell you. I don't really miss the staff. The staff, it's like negative, dark, a lot of haters, you know, typical jobs. Every job has its issues. But I do miss the inmates. So there are times when I'm like, oh, I kind of miss them. So that's what I did for most of my life. I was an officer and people get so surprised. They're like, I thought you were a nurse or, or a teacher. Cause I do not look like an officer, nor do I sound, nor do I act like one, honey. But Trust and believe I got those girls together. I mean, I ain't gonna lie, I got cussed out a bunch of times and got into some scruffles and stuff. But, you know, they cussed me out every day. But I wasn't all like, oh my God, no, I wasn't that girl. You know, it's, there's a difference. You gotta separate this from that, so. Um, but it was a great career and I 100% miss it. But I just wanted to share with you guys a little bit more about myself because um, I feel like I haven't told you guys anything about me. Um, and I'm always on Instagram and doing all these random little videos. They're like, girl, you need to do a YouTube. And I'm like, girl, what's that? I'm just playing. I knew what it was. But I was just like, I don't know. It sounds, you know, I'm not really good with technology. But I decided to just go out on a whim and do it. And it's been great. And it's been a lot of fun. Um, and I just really appreciate my people for being there for my YouTube journey. It's been a journey, okay? And it's gonna continue to be a journey because there's so many people out there who do this so amazing and so graceful and so beautifully. I feel like my stuff's so low budget and bootleg, but I think with the time, I think it's gonna get better because I can look back at my first videos and I'm like, oh, I come far. I came really far because they was looking a hot mess. I was looking a mess. I mean, I ain't looking that much better now, but I, I see the progress. And so I wanna be that for you guys. And 
I just wanted to chit chat with my people since I didn't come on here. I didn't do anything this week. I was at the eye doctor, the dentist. Honey, you know it's the end of the year. You know y'all gotta use your insurance because if you don't use it, you lose it. So I've been everywhere. I'm getting all my checkups. I think it's very important to prevent stuff. Girl, boy, y'all, he, she, they, whatever. Ooh, I left that dentist's office, honey. I got a filling in the crown. Girl, why was it uh, like $1,000? And I'm like, dang, what's the point of me having insurance? How much was it too? Girl, but you know you gotta take care of your teeth. Um, so my crown's super old, like with metal, and they don't do metal anymore, girl. So I gotta go get that done Monday. I'll be at the dentist. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to talk to y'all, honey, because I'm gonna be like all nasty and stuff and all numb and feeling all crazy. But that's what I'm doing next week. But I am coming to you with the 12 days of Christmas. I don't want y'all to forget about me, honey, because out of sight, out of mind, no, 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 we're not gonna do that over here. Y'all gonna be thinking about me. I'm gonna be giving you, coming to y'all with a little stuff to do. But thank you for listening to my car drive and me rant, just about random stuff. I appreciate you guys <laughs> who are taking your time and hanging out with me for my girls' night and, and going through this drive with me because, you know, you heard old girls say it's a 17-minute delay and I am pissed. And we're going to be late, but that's okay. Them heifers ain't even left their house, so it is what it is. Thank you. I love you guys so much. Stay tuned. I promise to get better and try to be more consistent and giving you what you want um drop down in the comments let me know things that you're interested in seeing also let me know if the i hate motorcycles let me know if the um 12 days of christmas is is a cool idea like what you'd be interested in seeing that even if y'all not honey i'm gonna do it anyway child it's like you know i need something to do so whether y'all like it or not you're gonna get it okay um i love you guys i will talk to you guys soon i love you have a great weekend thanks for watching